Hey, what's going on, y'all? This is Road Dex, uh, Road DDO. I uh, just want to let you know that uh, I did, uh, I did indeed die, um, as you saw in the last video. But then I just told myself it must be because I'm, you know, uh, distracted trying to make a video that I died like that. And so after I got off with y'all, what happened was I died three more times. Yeah. So, died three more times in a, a scenario I never have died before. And that's because I, I recognize a few things. Number one, I'm treating my, my druid like she's a, a, a wizard. And she's not a wizard, she's a druid. Therefore, uh, yeah. Just trying to go in and, you know, nuke everything, that's not her. She's a damage over time kind of person. Number two, I made a mistake and not have a hireling besides Frogo. Frogo's only level three. I didn't have a hireling. Take a hireling with you. Especially uh, the cleric to heal you. Because number four, the only healing you really have is this and this. I need to get some uh, Cure Series room uh, of Hots. So that's the only real healing you have. Besides, of course, Death Eater. Which gives you a hit points. In my case, I get 51. So... And then another thing I did is... I... Respect my points. Took some out here. Added three into the standing night fighter. Right now I only got one in Falconry. Because I found out that having daggers is a lot more reliable at the present time. You see my stats. One dagger is for my spell um, my spell powers. And then another one is, you know, it does poison damage, which I need to find one that actually does like electricity or something. Because poison type of poison or acid. Yeah. Anyway. So, uh, yeah, that, that's that's where I'm at. And the Stanny, it seems to me, I attack better or faster with the daggers, especially if I keep putting points in the Stanny and get haste boost. The other thing I thought about, because generally I like to play range, I thought about uh, multi-classing into a ranger. It's one level of ranger or a rogue and get short bows. But if I go to ranger, I prefer ranger because I can become an arcane archer. Just for a couple levels and then I, then I can uh, redo it all over again and get rid of the ranger, the, the ranger level until she gets, you know, uh, spells and enough, you know, enough uh, spell points. So those are my thoughts. Um, I tried another video before. It was a little bit longer and it's way longer than it is. Um, but I asked the question, if you had to multi-class uh, this character, what would you multi-class her, multi her into? Like, if you had to put at least one or two um, levels of something, what would you use? Yeah, I'm the one that likes to multi-class, and I understand that spell curses are always better pure. I, I understand. But my question is, okay, point. Um, what would what class would you use to help the druid? Would you use rogue for the evasion and the traps? Would you use uh, ranger for bows and whatever? Or would you be fancy and and put a little monk in there so she uses hand wraps? Which would be kind of cool, actually. Uh, if you had the multi -class, multi class, what would you use? Barbarian for more speed. Out. The massive gate nearby pushes open as guards rush out. I remember what I said. The druid is not a nuker. For those who never played. This boy you going in and using thorn uh thorn bloom and then or entangle, sitting in a tangle, or whatever it is, Time to spike growth. The you know, these two 
but it's not a nuke. Damage over time. And if you don't remember that, you're in trouble. This ship is important to be supplied. It would be a shame if something were to prevent the pirates from So that's the two daggers. Runs to the gong on deck and rings it. Reinforcements spring forth to attack. Three punks. <laughs> See, that's a problem right there. That's why I prefer range. See. That was supposed to be under me, but it went somewhere else. And that's my problem with 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 uh, Druid. My problem with Druid is um, aiming the spike growth and all that kind of stuff. It's not centered on me. It's always somewhere else. I don't like that. That means I got to run to it. And I'm getting mobbed and it can't run. I know you use tumble, but I never use tumble. Anyway, yeah, that's a problem. The other problem, of course, is spell points. Still running out of spell points. So this seven minutes already. And those are the questions. What would what would you multi uh, multi class your druid into if you had to? Um, just for flavor or whatever. And or the blight caster should say. What would you multi class that that character into if you had to? So uh, let me know. I'm just interested in the topic because I don't see a whole lot of builds of, of blight caster on. Uh, Forms or online, anything else? I really don't see it. Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, and I thank you for everybody that has uh, subscribed. Bye.